Okay, this is an unboxing of the Insignia Clock Radio. I'm not sure what the model name is. I think it's the NCCL01, but I could be wrong. Okay, let's open it up. Aha! Clock. It's pink. Great. Uh, what is this? How do I get this out of one hand? Use my foot. Ah, damn. Turn it down. Oh, interchangeable face plates. Useful. So it doesn't have to be pink, and I don't look like a... Not just pink. That's what I have to do. Um... Okay, it looks like we got a charger. And... Thing. Yeah, more of these things. I don't know what they are, but... They might be too small. Obviously, it came with it. Let's see. Ah, damn. Okay, uh, let me stop the video to take this thing out, because I'm tearing it apart right now. Okay, so, after taking this out, I've... There's nothing else in the box, so this box can just go away. So here's the clock. Uh, let's take it out of the package. Plastic, let's see. And yes, I'm on the floor, that's why I'm using my foot. Hey, look, it's got flimsy antenna. Oh, looks like a wire to me, so... Nevertheless, an antenna. Well, we have the little clock display right here. Looks like crap. And hey, look at that glare. Hello. See me? Yeah. Okay, no. Uh, here's a button. Okay, my camera just ran out of battery, and in the time that it did, after I charged it, I have opened this thing. I've brought out my iPod, test with the iPod dock it has right here, and I have interchanged the faceplate from gay pink to awesome blue. Yeah. Awesome, right? Actually, the to note, the face plates come off very easily, so don't be dropping this or throwing it downstairs, because it will break. Now, here's the anal coil um, uh, antenna that was on it, and I'll need to uncoil that, but it's a pain in the ass with, to do with one hand, and frankly to do with two, so I'm going to save that for later. Now, the clock. Let's put this thing on. Apparently it's supposed to support your iPod. This thing says iPod Photo. I didn't find one for iPod Touch, so I'm just gonna use this with it. Uh, put it in like that. No. That. No. Obviously like that. Yep. Ah, snaps in. And now we'll have to take out the DV thing. Uh, DV, not DV. Uh, the AC, I think, AC adapter, yeah. And my four AA, three, no, where's my four? Four AA batteries. No, the AA batteries go in right here. This thing comes out real easily. Just pull it out. And ooh, it came with one of those circular watch battery things that I think goes in here. That's weird. Oh, uh, what's this? Looks like a ribbon. Uh, is there a message on it? Nope. Uh, well, I don't see the point of this battery as it already works with these four AA batteries. So that is weird. Now, maybe it's not really for that, but now you can fit a penny in here. See? Put it right in. Nope, that doesn't fit. Anyway. So I'm going to proceed to put the AA batteries in unless I have to put this one in first. In which case, it would be very, very weird. Now, uh... Great, I have to open this with one hand. Hold on, let me open it. Okay, I've opened it, and it's a lithium battery. Energizer quality. So, I don't know which way I'm supposed to put it in, so I'm just going to put it in this way. 
because that's the way I guess it's supposed to go in. Is it? Maybe not. Let's put it in that way. That might work, but it seems like it stuck now and refuses to come out. So that might be a pain in the ass. Well, it's not coming out, so I hope it will work. Unless I try pulling it a different way. It's not working either. Dad is here with pocket knife skills. Got it? Mm -hmm. Is that the right way? I'm not sure. Well, we're looking. Hang on. What, what does instruction say? I haven't looked at the instructions. Well, you need to look at the instructions. Okay. Okay, so my dad just came and saved the day with his mad army knife skills. And turns out I had the battery in the wrong way. Meaning that I have to put it in the right way now. This is the right way with the little plus symbol on top. So once I've got it in, then now I put the AA batteries in. Now, I hope I know how to put them in, or else I'm retarded. So, I got one, got two, got three, got four. Great. Now, gotta put the cover on. There. So, now the clock should be on. What do you know? Twelve o'clock. It is not 12 o'clock. Okay. Oh, the ribbon sticking out. I don't know what the ribbon was, but it was inside, so I'm going to keep it inside. Go back inside, ribbon. Damn it. Shit. Stupid ribbon. What? I don't know what the point of the ribbon was, but... I assume it was to put some brain factor in here. Or, I don't know, just to piss you off. Okay, let me turn on the video to get the ribbon back in. I forgot to put the battery cover back on, so I have to deal with the pain in the ass ribbon again after I take out the batteries. Great. Okay, that's one. That's two. Great. No battery cover. There. I think it's in place now. I gotta put the batteries back in. Got one. Got two. Great. Cover on. Oh yeah. Deal with the annoying ass ribbon found the trick. You fold it like shit. You fold it in like that so it doesn't bother you. Die stupid ribbon. There. Got the ribbon in. Now I think I'm about to run out. Well the sound quality is pretty good. Watch. Gary Jules, Mad World. It was in the Gears trailer. Good song. Yeah, it's a pretty good quality. I'm impressed. Now, I'll have to reset the clock later, but you don't need to see me do that. Well, thanks for watching, and remember to subscribe. This is Spaz Gaming.